shortcut key number one control plus n you can press control plus n anywhere to open a new query based on the current connection for example if i select database one from server local slash sql 2016 it will open us a new query which belongs to local slash sql 2016 database one and if i select a database two and press ctrl plus n it will automatically open a new query on database two local slash sql 2016 and if i select another server it will open us a new query on that server shortcut key number two ctrl plus a4 you can use ctrl plus a4 to close current query let's say i am working on the test number one and i want to close the current query so i can simply press ctrl f4 and of course if you haven't saved the query it will ask you if you want to save it or not so i don't want to save it and it will automatically goes to the next query and i can press ctrl plus f4 to close this window as well shortcut key number three alt you can press alt to navigate through the main menus press alt you can use the arrows to navigate for example project query file view anywhere and simply just hit enter to execute it shortcut key number four shift plus f10 you can use shift plus f10 to open the context menu for example let's open a new query and write query number one and if i want to copy it or whatever i can select it and press shift plus f10 to open the context menu and you can choose any of them by hitting the enter shortcut key number five control plus tab you can use control plus tab to navigate through the active queries or the tool windows you can simply hold down the control and press the tab it will go one by one through the active files and if you want to navigate to the active tool windows you can press the left arrow and after that you can use up and down to navigate through the active windows just like that and hit enter to set the focus on the selected window or file shortcut key number six f5 you can use f5 to execute the current query just like that and shortcut key number seven is alt plus break we can use alt plus break to cancel or stop the current running query alt break it will cancel it query was cancelled by user shortcut key number eight shift plus alt plus enter you can use shift plus alt plus enter to go to the full screen mode and you can get back to the normal window by pressing again the shift alt enter shortcut key number nine control plus j sometimes when you write code and for some reason you have to go to somewhere else and get back and when you're getting back the intelligence won't show you the suggestions what you have to do you have to re rewrite the phrase or you can press ctrl plus j to show you the list of suggestions and you can select one of them shortcut key number 10 f8 sometimes for any reason you may close the object explorer and if you want to open it back you can press f8 to open the object explorer again shortcut key number 11 f4 you can use f4 to open the properties window shortcut key number 12 shift plus escape if the focus is on any of the tool windows properties object explorer tasks list or any other tool window you can simply press shift plus escape to close the selected tool window just like that shortcut key number 13 ctrl k ctrl k 
here for example you have a long query and you want to add a bookmark here just press ctrl k ctrl k twice it will create a bookmark and you can remove it by pressing ctrl k ctrl k again shortcut key number 14 let's say i have a bookmark here and a bookmark here and a bookmark here I can use Ctrl K, Ctrl N to navigate to the next bookmark. Ctrl K, Ctrl N, Ctrl K, Ctrl N, Ctrl K, Ctrl N, Ctrl K, Ctrl N, just like that. Or I can use shortcut number 15, which is Ctrl K, Ctrl P, which, which will go to the previous bookmark. Ctrl K, Ctrl P, Ctrl K, Ctrl P, Ctrl K, Ctrl P. So the Ctrl K, Ctrl N goes to the next bookmark and Ctrl K, Ctrl P goes to the previous bookmark. Short key number 16. Ctrl K, Ctrl N. If I want to remove, clear all the bookmarks that I have done for the open queries, simply I can press Ctrl K, Ctrl N. And it will give me a message box which says, are you sure you want to delete all the bookmarks? And I can say yes. Shortcut key number 17, F9. You can use F9 to add or remove breakpoint. And shortcut key number 18 is Ctrl plus F9. We can use Ctrl plus F9 to enable or disable the breakpoint. And shortcut key number 19, Ctrl shift F9. It will clear all the breakpoints that you have made. Shortcut key number 20. Let's say if I have here a breakpoint and another one here, another one here, and I can press Ctrl Alt and B, it will open the breakpoints list. Shortcut key number 21 is Ctrl Alt and A. We can press Ctrl Alt and A open the activity monitor and the shortcut key number 22 is control plus one control plus one will automatically execute the sp who and of course by using the sp who you can see the current connection is and their status